Hey guys, welcome to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food, and I am here today with a Kroger haul. I didn't need much, but they had a lot of great sales today, and I wanted to take advantage of them. Today is Wednesday, March 29th, so this sale is going to be going on until next Tuesday. I spent $96 and some change, so I will jump right in. So I'll start over here with the produce and I grabbed this um, salad on sale or lettuce on sale, I should say, for $1.32 and this large bag of spinach on sale for 98 cents, great deals. I grabbed some tortillas for my husband. He just likes to have these on hand and he uses them as wraps all the time during the week because he does work from home. This pasta was on sale for 99 cents if you downloaded the digital coupon. We don't need any pasta, but when I find it on sale, I tend to grab it. So I got some fettuccine, angel hair pasta, thin spaghetti. I also got some bow tie pasta and some manicotti. I grabbed some uh, croissants as well. Now I also grabbed these. Um, these dumplings and they were a new item at Kroger and I guess because they were new they had them on sale so they were a dollar off. I think they were five dollars and some change and I looked at the ingredients and I'll show them to you and the ingredients right here pretty simple so I just wanted to give them a try. It looks like you get about 21 in a package so I will pan fry those one day. And I grabbed some ice cream. These were on sale um, for $2.99 each. And I grabbed the Irish cream brownie for Howard. And then I grabbed this honey salted caramel almond for me. Plus I had a like preferred customer coupon. So I got $2.50 off of these ice creams, which was a great deal. I love to just have queso dip on hand. This is not the brand that I usually buy, but this one was on sale and was cheaper than the one that I normally buy. So I just decided to give it a try. I grabbed some of these honey graham sticks for my toddler. He used to eat these all the time and then he stopped, but um, I decided to buy them again today to see if he'd try them out again. This Sargento cheese was totally free as a preferred um, shopper there. And then I got my son these goldfish grams, which he loves, vanilla cupcakes. So I got him three of those. And I also got him these smoothies, which he really likes. Now I accidentally grabbed this strawberry banana. He doesn't really care for bananas, but I also got him a strawberry one, which he does like. The Jeff peanut butter was on sale for $1.99. So I grabbed a um, creamy peanut butter one and then a creamy, I'm sorry, an extra crunchy one as well. And these don't expire, I think, until 2025. So I thought that was pretty good. Jump down here, their eggs are on sale this week. 18 count for $1.99, which is a still, I think they had a limit of five, but I just needed one. On their clearance aisle, they had this oat flour, and I thought that was a pretty good deal. You can see the regular price is $5.49, and I snagged it for $1.65. I'm gonna look up some recipes that I can make with this oat flour. Another thing that they had on sale there is their di blue diamond almonds, six ounces. They had different flavors, and these were $1.99. So I decided to try the elote flavor and the Korean barbecue flavor. Um, I also grabbed these, um, the pasta sauce, which is, which is on sale for 99 cents. I got a lower sodium one, chunky mushroom and onion, and a chunky green pepper and mushroom. Again, we don't need these, but when staples go on sale, I just grab them. Grabbed a couple of milks for my toddler. And then as a treat, I brought I bought him this strawberries and cream and I usually cut it with whole milk. So like 75% whole milk. And then I add just a little bit of strawberries and cream. Their flour was on sale. And I think it was $2.99. And then I got my husband a couple of these peanuts. They were on sale for $1.99 as well. That was a great deal and he loves to snack on them. I got him lightly salted, but they also had just honey roasted and the regular salted. 
um, as well. Grabbed him some ketchup. That was also on sale. They're 20 ounces for $1.99. And then I got my toddler this um, soft baked, these soft baked oatmeal, baked oatmeal squares. Can't talk. He really likes these things a lot. And then I got a couple of non-food items. These I found on the clearance aisle, these Puffs Plus Lotion. You get three of the three boxes, 124 in each box. And these were either 524 or 424. Whatever they were, they were almost half price. We don't need them, but I grabbed them because we all have allergies. Harrison is in preschool. You know, all the time he's getting like a, a runny nose or a cough or something. Plus they always need these for school. So I couldn't help but to grab them. They were a great deal. And then I needed some more of these wipes. Now I've never tried the Arm & Hammer. I hope they smell really good and I hope they're pretty thick, but just wanted to try something new other than my Lysol. So this is everything that I picked up on my quick Kroger haul. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, we'd love to have you. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you all next time.